Okay, going. Hello, and welcome to a special edition of Let's Drive Columbus. This is Let's Drive Columbus number one, in which we see the uh, temporary configuration of eastbound Interstate 670. Uh, camera forward, please, Ed. Uh, we are approaching exit 2, which is Route 315. The, uh, the exit to 315 North has been made exit only in order to drop a lane entering the construction zone. Also, the speed limit drops to 45 miles per hour here, where previously it was uh, only around 55. If they're going to drop a lane through here, I suppose this is the best place to do it. <coughs> Although I think uh, I might have done a little bit, uh, done some of the signs a little bit differently. But hey, I don't, uh, I don't, I don't work for Coco Sick So this Neil Avenue exit is pretty much normal. The entrance ramp from Neal Avenue, though, is a little bit different. I'll point that out as we get to it. Uh, this is the entrance from 315 southbound coming up on the right. And yeah, lots of uh, lots of orange here. The uh, this right lane is going to be exit only. Line isn't aligned properly, but this right lane is exit only to Third Street. There's the entrance from Neal Avenue coming up on the right, but it doesn't actually get to enter just yet. In fact, it gets shunted off to what's normally the Fourth Street exit. And as we're going under Goodale Street and the High Street cap, yeah, you can see people well, don't read the signs. Yeah, they really ought to. A anyway. We are uh, crossing over onto what's normally the west wings, westbound lanes of 670 at this point. Uh, and uh, just up ahead, there's this uh, exit to Cleveland Avenue. That will remain open during the duration of Phase 1. Uh, the way they aligned it, though, is a little bit different. Like you're crossing over and then crossing back. I'm not sure why exactly they did that. So now we're on some temporary pavement here, which is normally just off the left shoulder of westbound 670. And, ooh, there's a lot of traffic on the right here. This traffic is entering from 3rd Street coming uh, north out of downtown and the Convention Center Drive, and that's also where that entrance from Neal Avenue will put you. And there's more lanes here than there usually is. We've got uh, four lanes which splits into three and two, with the left lane ending on each side of the split. Um, yeah, there's the left lane ending now. And now we're back on pavement that hasn't really been reconfigured, although it's currently carrying the through lanes of 670, when normally this is still the entrance to 670 from 3rd Street. Uh, this ramp coming in on the right is coming from 71 southbound. In the construction documents, they call this eastbound I-670 spur. I don't know. To me, it's always just been a ramp that looks like a freeway or, or an unnumbered section of the northeast freeway. So, these lanes coming on to the right, from the right um, are uh, coming from... 71 northbound. Ordinarily, that would be the through lanes of 670, and will again in the future. Uh, but uh, for about a year, that won't be the case. That just about covers it. Um, I can uh, I can tell it to stop recording now. See you later.